The Alienware AW3423DW, Samsung Odyssey G 949 inch, LG32 GS95 UE, Bank Zowie XL 2586X, and the MSI 321 URX are the most popular gaming monitors of 2024, but which is the absolute best. We're going to compare them to each other and score them in various categories, with some categories holding more weight than others. In the end, we'll decide which is the best one based on the final score, and we will declare the absolute winner. Let's dive in. First, we are going to compare them on the display quality category, which has a multiplier of 2.5. The Alienware AW3423DW boasts a stunning QD OLED panel with perfect blacks and vivid colors, but its 1800R curve may be too aggressive for some. I give it a solid 9 out of 10. Next up, the Samsung Odyssey G 949 inches delivers an immersive experience with its super ultra-wide aspect ratio and impressive HDR performance, though its VA panel can't quite match the contrast of OLED. It earns an 8.5 out of 10 for me. The LG 32 GS 95 UE is another OLED contender, offering gorgeous visuals and epic contrast, but it falls slightly short in color accuracy and brightness compared to its rivals. Still, a respectable 8 out of 10. Moving on to the BenQ Zowie XL 2586X, this TN panel prioritizes speed over picture quality, resulting in grayish blacks and limited color reproduction. A 6.5 out of 10 for display quality. Finally, the MSI 321 URX showcases the power of QD OLED with its near-infinite contrast ratio and wide color gamut, making it a top choice for both gaming and content creation. It gets a well-deserved 9.5 out of 10 in my book. After tallying up the scores, the MSI 321 URX takes the crown with 23.75 points, thanks to its exceptional QD OLED panel that delivers unrivaled picture quality and versatility. Next, we are going to compare them on the refresh rate and response time category, which has a multiplier of two. The Alienware AW3423DW boasts a 175Hz refresh rate and an incredible 0.1ms response time, eliminating ghosting and delivering buttery smooth motion. However, it lacks a motion blur reduction feature, which might be a deal breaker for some competitive gamers. I give it a 9 out of 10. Moving on to the Samsung Odyssey G949. This behemoth rocks a 240Hz refresh rate and a 1ms response time, ensuring lightning fast gameplay. It also supports FreeSync and G-Sync. But like the Alienware, it doesn't have motion blur reduction. It gets a solid 9.5 out of 10. The LG32 GS95UE is a speed demon with its 240Hz refresh rate at 4K and a mind-blowing 480Hz at 1080p, thanks to its dual mode feature. With a 0.03 MS response time, this monitor is a dream for esports enthusiasts. It easily earns a perfect 10 out of 10. Next up, the Benk Zowie XL 2586X is a true esports champion flaunting a jaw-dropping 540 hertz refresh rate and a fast response time that keeps motion incredibly sharp. The only downside is the increased motion blur at lower refresh rates. Despite that, it secures a 9.5 out of 10. Last but not least, the MSI 321 URX QD OLED impresses with a 240 hertz refresh rate and near instantaneous response time, resulting in exceptionally crisp motion. It maintains its performance across all refresh rates, making it a versatile choice. It gets a well-deserved 9.5 out of 10. After tallying up the scores, the LG 32 GS 95 UE emerges as the clear winner in this category with a perfect 10, thanks to its innovative dual mode feature that allows for both high resolution and ultra high refresh rates, catering to a wide range of gaming preferences. Next, we are going to compare them on the connectivity and features category, which has a multiplier of 1.5. The Alienware AW 3423DW has a solid selection of ports, including DisplayPort and HDMI, but it lacks USB-C, which is a bit disappointing. I'll give it a 7.5 out of 10. Moving on to the Samsung Odyssey G949. It offers a similar setup with DisplayPort and HDMI along with a USB hub. However, it also misses out on USB-C, so it gets a 7.5 as well. Next up is the LG 32 GS95 UE, and this one really steps it up in the connectivity department. It's got DisplayPort, two HDMI 2.1 ports, a USB hub, and even a headphone jack with DTS Headphone X support. That's an impressive array of options, so I'm giving it a 9 out of 10. The Bank Zowie XL 2586X is a bit more basic, with DisplayPort and HDMI ports, but no USB hub or USB-C. It does have some gaming-specific features like DIAC, though. I'll give it a 6.5 out of 10 for connectivity. Finally, we have the MSI 321 URX, and this one is packed with ports. DisplayPort, two HDMI 2.1, USB-C with power delivery and a USB hub. It even has a KVM switch and HDMI CC support. This one easily earns a 9.5 out of 10. 
The MSI 321 URX takes the win in this category with an impressive 9.5 points thanks to its extensive port selection and bonus features that make it extremely versatile for both gaming and productivity. Next, we are going to compare them on the design and build quality category, which has a multiplier of 1.5. The Alienware AW3423DW has a premium design with a glossy screen and a sturdy white stand that offers a full range of ergonomic adjustments. However, its chunky side profile might not be for everyone. I'll give it an 8.5 out of 10. Moving on to the Samsung Odyssey G9, it boasts an aggressive 1000R curved screen and a heavy stand that keeps it stable. That said, the massive 49-inch size requires a deep desk. It gets an 8 out of 10 from me. Next up, the LG 32 GS95 UE features a sleek design with slim bezels and a sturdy stand that provides excellent ergonomics, including pivot adjustment. The only downside is the slightly grainy anti-glare coating. It deserves a solid 9 out of 10. The Bank Zowie XL 2586X, on the other hand, prioritizes function over form with its impressive ergonomics and cable management. While it may not be the most stylish, it's built like a tank. I'm giving it an 8.5 out of 10. Last but not least, the MSI 321 URX offers a similar design to other QD OLED monitors with slim bezels and a sturdy stand. It also has a handy KVM switch for multitasking. Although it lacks the premium flair of some competitors, it still earns a respectable 8.5 out of 10. After careful consideration, the LG32 GS95 UE takes the crown in this category with nine points. Thanks to its sleek aesthetics, excellent ergonomics, and solid build quality that strikes the perfect balance between style and functionality. Finally, we are going to compare them on the value for money category, which has a multiplier of 2.5. The Alienware AW3423DW offers stunning QD OLED visuals and a fast 175 Hz refresh rate, but its high price tag may be a deal breaker for some. I give it a 7 out of 10 for value. Next up, the Samsung Odyssey G 949 inches delivers an immersive experience with its massive curved screen and impressive specs, though its price is also on the higher end. It gets an 8 out of 10 from me. The LG 32 GS95 UE is a fantastic all-rounder with its 4K 240Hz OLED panel and great features, providing excellent value despite its premium price. It deserves a solid 9 out of 10. Now, the Benkut Zowie XL 2586X is a top choice for competitive gamers with its insane 540Hz refresh rate, but its TN panel and lack of HDR support may not justify its cost for everyone. I rate it a 7 out of 10 for value. Last but not least, the MSI 321 URX packs a punch with its QD OLED tech, 240Hz refresh rate, and useful extras like a KVM switch, making it a compelling option for its price. It gets a strong 9 out of 10 in my book. After tallying up the scores, the LG32 GS95 UE and MSI 321 URX come out on top with 22.5 points each, thanks to their exceptional performance and feature set that justify their price tags, making them the winners of the value for money category. The results of our comparison show each product shines in its own way, but the MSI 321 URX stands out with its score of 92.25. This QD OLED powerhouse takes the crown thanks to its exceptional display quality, high refresh rate, and comprehensive connectivity. Whether you're gaming, creating content, or multitasking with its built-in KVM switch, the MSI 321 URX delivers unmatched versatility. It outperformed its competitors in most categories, excelling particularly in display quality and overall value for money, making it the best all-around gaming monitor of 2024. That said, the other monitors still deserve recognition for their unique strengths. The LG32 GS95 UE with a score of 89.5 came in a close second, boasting a phenomenal refresh rate and dual mode functionality making it perfect for esports enthusiasts. The Samsung Odyssey G9 49, with its massive curved screen and immersive experience, scored 83.5, making it a great choice for those who want a larger-than-life gaming setup. Meanwhile, the Alienware AW3423DW and Venka Zowie XL 2586X, scoring 82 and 75.25 respectively, also have their merits particularly for those prioritizing speed or specific gaming features. Each monitor has something special to offer, but the MSI 321 URX is the one that truly checks all the boxes.